So these are all the lambs for sale. The only one not for sale is Lilac, who's the gray one. Because I want to see, experiment and see what she's like uh, down the road for breeding, etc. If it's a genetic issue, the graying, or if it's uh, an issue that she was immune compromised and her melanoma cells turned her fleece gray. So it might have nothing to do with um, genetics and purely to do with her immune system uh, when she was a lamb that made her wool turn gray. So these are all the lambs, you lambs for sale. Nice variety of them. So there's two, four, six, eight. And there's only one that has a bit of off-white. A bit of white in the fleece. Otherwise, I think they're all very well marked. So only the gray lamb is not for sale. She's called Lilac and she's very well marked and I really like her breeding. So I'm keeping her and to see what happens with the gray fleece. All these other ones are for sale and on the market. So they're all in pretty good nick. That's the only yellow lamb that's mismarked. She's the only one not for sale. So all of these are for sale. Okay. All the lambs are gonna rejoin up. The sun is going down. Whoops. Oh. I've gotta pick this up. This is the magic bucket. No, you're not coming through yet. Hey, babies. Hey, babies. Yeah. Ah. Very hard time opening the eight. There you go.
Okay. It's gonna all go. Ugh. I'm having a hard time. This gate the grass is so thick. And close that. Now the magic bucket. I don't know where the other dogs are. Oh, there you are. You're on the other side of the gate. I was wondering where you guys were. I was wondering where you guys were. Come on. Come on. We had Junior. And I had the big old German Shepherd. Okay. Lilac is easy to spot. Okay, girls and boys. We're going back out to the field. Mind you don't get stampled. Come on, babies. Are you stuck on that side? Come on. <laughs> oh, look at that pathetic look. Saying, please, I'll pick you up. The older ones can do it themselves. Come here. Yes. Oh, the smell of nettles is amazing. Okay, you're through the worst of it. Now you can do the rest of it. I've got to go down here now. Hopefully the lambs haven't completely run away on me. I can't wait till these silver birch are taller and I'll be walking through a corridor of trees. It'll be magnificent. You can see the St. John's wort in there and the pheasant eye. Pheasant eye berry is going. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Okay. Now, let's see where everybody is. They're probably grazing. There they are. Having the nibbles. Inca, Inca, Inca. Leave it. Leave it. Leave it. They're having the nibbles. Allow them. Inca, Inca, Inca. No. 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 Leave it. See, they're getting tannins from those cherry trees. Cherry tree leaves. They're having lots of lovely nibbles. There's some willow over there. Oh, and the cow parsley is getting a munch. Magic bucket! Does its magic! All circling around me again. Tripping me up. There we go. Okay, leave it. Leave it. Good dogs. Here's the beginner. Up, oh, and you're all coming back up again because I haven't given you your magic bucket reward. 
now. There we go. My, the magic bucket reward works. <clears throat> works a treat. Yum, 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 yum. Okay. You clever pup, you got out of the way, didn't you? Yeah. So I gotta remember when I'm counting that I'm minus a few. Now to open this gate and let them out. There we go. There we go. Come on, out you go, go on, come on, come on, Who? come on, are you going to help me or not, are you just going to watch, come on, Inga's only interested in getting some sheep food pellets, come on, there we go, out you go, go on ladies and gents, go on, There we go. Job done. Here's the alpaca down there. Now I have to do some horse moving. Just fencing adjustments, not moving, moving. Just to give them more grass. Where are you going? No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No! Where do you all think you're going? Huh? Nope. Nope. I'll throw the mineral bucket over the fence. But you're not coming in here. How are you, Lilac? You're Gracie's daughter, aren't you? And I'm keeping you. You're a beautiful girl, despite you being gone silver. You silly pup. Yeah, I've got a puppy and a cat helping the fence at the moment. Not the easiest. You guys don't do anything. cat has been chasing the... You've been doing those, haven't you? Because I've been dragging the fence and the puppy gets involved. I know I just set this up, but this is what I've been dealing with. <laughs> Oop, there he goes. <laughs> and he got yanked because it ended the fence. Okay. I'm nearly done anyway. And the horses are up there grazing their new pasture. So you can see where they've grazed here and they've got the new stuff there. Isn't that right? Yes. Yes. Okay. I've got to finish doing this with two hands. Oh. There goes the cat helping again. Can you let go? There we go. And there we go. Done. Tie them up a little bit, but no more playtime with cats and fencing. Tie this off. Mustard kitty! Kitty kitty! Bring the puppy back! 
Come on, pup. Out a good boy. Good boy. Come on. Out a boy. Come on. Finding your way through the deep grass. Well, relatively deep grass. It's not very deep. Good boy. Yes. You're so good. Oh, you're so good. Yes. Yes. Clever pup. Okay, now I gotta go turn the electric fence on. Isn't that right, all you lot? Yeah. Whoops. That fence post <clears throat> has gone bent. There, that's much better. Upright. Now, the horses have a good strip to graze. Now I go and turn the electric fence on. Lots of munchies. A beautiful rainbow. I'm walking down to turn the fence on. And I spotted this beautiful rainbow. It's a really wide one. You can kind of see it goes from there to there. But the bottom bit is the part we see. It's disappearing now. Okay, turn on the electric fence. Yay! And the job is done.